Hello everybody, today I will show you how to install and configure the car tracking solution which is the tracking solution for your car. This software is based on Android device, for example the smartphone and the service called Spysat EU. How to start? Let's start from the page when you can find all the information which you need to create account and start working with the Spice at EU site. Uh, you can read here some useful tips according to uh, installation of the transmitter which is the smartphone inside your car but uh, basically the principle is the same for all the cars. You need to download the application from Google Play. The application is called Car Tracking. Or you can also download the APK directly in the web page. Then you need to go to Spice site, which is uh, described somewhere here. If you don't know the uh, URL, it's, it's simply Spiced.eu and you have to create an account. Let's create an account, for example, let's say it uh, test123 password uh, test. You don't need to give an address. Okay, and we have no devices. We need to create device, so we need to click up device and add the device. Let's see, let's call it the HTC One. Mine is not necessary, and the pin code. Let's see, five four three two one, and we click add. This is all. The device has been de deployed. There is no data by now. And now we need to switch to the phone. I have already installed this uh, uh, this application on the phone. I will try to show you how it looks like using the capture screen the ATB console. Uh, this is quite big uh, so I will try to describe you what you need to click. The first thing when you start the application you will see that you have to just go to settings and set up your login and password. So we click the settings. We click the settings and refresh seconds okay so the settings look like this and I will get here in the spice set login I will type our login which was uh, test one two three it okay so I click OK login is set and the second thing is to set the device pin which is already uh, typed I have give it by the second before so you need to give the login test one to three because you have a created an account here. Remember the account was test one to three, and you give the device pin. If you don't remember, you can simply click on the device and check what the pin is. Please don't give here the password to the website because website it used to see used to browse the position of the marker and. You need to specify it anytime the device pin. 
so we have the device called uh, HTC One, uh, my device, in which uh, and on the application you get the Spicer login test one two three and device pin five four three two one, and we click back on the phone. Refresh. And what we will see, yes, we get the tracking information from the server that the server connection is okay. Uh, I don't have uh, the GPS actually yet because I'm in the building, so I need to wait some time to get the position. Maybe if I move, close the window. I will get the position. Not at all. But don't worry. It's gonna catch the fix in a few seconds. And now. Uh, I would like to uh, show you how to use those applications. There is no signal yet from the phone, so we are waiting for, for the, uh, the signal. I will go and put on the window. Okay, and we get the position. So now we can uh, go back to website and check where the phone actually is. Okay, we get the information that this is our location. So we are here and can move right now but uh, if you get the real time you will be seeing the moving position of, of the phone and you can also uh, browse the history of uh, the position and if you want to see the data acquired by the service you can browse it here um, actually that's all that's all if you want to use spice it as a car tracking feature you can use it it's completely free thanks for watching